in this class we are going to print this pattern using c programming language so you can see here one is one time two is two time three is three time then four is four time five is five time so what is the logic and how to write the program code you can see this is the program code for this pattern so you can see you hear decoration header file then main function then which variable we are used i n j n for input value okay you store the value of n in n then a for loop execution of 1 to 5 execute 1 to 5 then for loop execute for 1 1 time print 2 2 time print and 3 3 time print okay so this is the for loop for 1 1 time print 2 2 time print 3 3 time print 4 4 time print 5 5 time print okay so and this for loop using we are used this for loop and print the value of i n 1 to 5 and this for loop repeat the number you can see here 2 2 time repeat 3 3 time repeat okay so now uh, let's see the example suppose you enter input value n equals to 5 okay then you can see here what happened i i values i values you can see i values 1 okay so 1 i values 1 and condition is i less than n so 1 less than equals to n n means 5 condition is true yes condition is true then insert in this for loop okay so in this for loop you can see that j j values initially 1 then condition j less than equals to y we know what is the value of i i values initialization a 1 so first and all j j means 1 1 less than equals to i values also 1 then condition is true so print the value of i and you can see in this pattern we are print the value of 1 that means i values okay one print and here increment the value of j j values is now increment and j values is 1 to 2 then condition is false if the condition is false then exit from this for loop and print the new line you can see this is the new line okay or in this new line again increment the value of i so print previous value 1 now increment i plus plus that means uh, now i values 2 here condition is also true then insert or check this condition j less than equals to i so j values initialization 1 then i values 2 okay i values i values i okay so i values 2 and this is the j value okay so pre this is the i value okay or this is the 5 is n value okay so denote this symbol okay so now see the i values 1 and sorry i values is 2 and j values is initialize 1 okay so condition is now true then print the value of i i what is the value of i 2 okay so print the value of i that means 2 this number is print now again increment the value of j now j values is 2 also condition is true then print the value of i i values 2 okay so print the value of 2 now increment the value of j j values is now 3 condition is false so don't print the value of i and here exit from for loop and print the value of slash n that means new line you can see now this is the new line okay 
so now here condition before i increment that is i increment now i value is 3 okay so condition is also true then next condition this condition is check for we know j values is realize 1 then i values 3 condition is true i values 3 condition is true true so print the value of i i values 3 here you can see this is the 3 print okay and uh, condition check so before condition check increment the value of j now j values increment 2 also condition is true so print the value of i i values 3 then 3 okay similarly up to this execution process up to n time so what is the value of n when i values increment step by step and i values then it's just, just 5 okay so 5 less than equals to 5 condition is true then here 1 and here <coughs> when reach the value of i equals to 5 then what happened i that is 5 5 less than equals to 5 condition is true then this condition check j less than equals to i j values 1 i values 5 condition is true then print the value of i i values 5 then print you can see 5 values print okay so now increment the value j i values now 2 then condition is true print the value of i then 5 print this number is print okay so now increment the value of increment the value of j 3 then condition is true and also print the value of i 5 i means 5 5 print in pattern okay then increment the value of 4 4 is also condition is true then 5 print okay 5 print then increment the value of j j value is 5 when 5 then print the value of i when increment the value of j is the 6 6 condition is false then exit from this body okay then print new line so print new line or new line then that means here okay and return 0 so run this program code execute execute compile and run so this is the output enter the value of n suppose you enter 5 so what is the value so this is the pattern this is the target point so thanks thanks you for watching so this is the program code or output so this is the program code or this is the pattern okay bye